sin. I did it myself, ear to ear, just like you wanted. Good boy. Leave us alone. I got business to discuss. I understand you supplied the heroin Georgia was selling. See, si, certo. I never wanted that in my city. Shit like that fucks with people's heads. It makes them crazy. Stupid. It brings down too much heat. Bourbon? No, I do not drink. Georgie, tell you why I wanted to meet. He said the nigger is causing you problem. That you wish to discuss a deal between the two of us? I'm building a casino across the lake. I had it all set. Now the rights to the land are all tied up. It's that goddamn mess. You won my money. I'm gonna need enough to pay for all the blood-sucking lawyers, and that's not cheap. I want to hear you say it. Say what? That you won my money. Say those words. Please. I want your money. This is good. I will bring you the money. And in exchange, you will let me sell heroin in your city. And you will not interfere in any way. Sure. Whatever you want. But that's not the only thing that you... You also wish for me to kill the nigger? I will do that for you as well. I enjoy killing the niggers. Jesus Christ. That's where Sammy's used to be. No one wanted to live there, so they uh, paved it over. Every now and then, something knocks the hell out of this country. Rattles it so hard, isn't much left but the foundation. And as painful as it is, we hope that this time, things are gonna be different. And that when it's time to rebuild, we won't just repeat what we've done in the past. And that maybe justice and peace will finally prevail. Justice and peace are hard, ain't it? Sometimes too hard. So we take the easy way. Oh, hey there, pal. How are you? I put Olivia Marcano in the hospital, but I'll be surprised if she makes it through the night. Sal's gonna know that he's lost Frisco Fields, that we've taken over his drug operations there and shut down his fucking greengrocer. He won't let that stand. You've helped me turn things around for the Irish in this town, changing lives in a major way. And you can be certain we'll take care of whatever territory you hand us. Makes sense you want to stay one step ahead of us. Not give any obvious tales which way you're leaning. But I will say it's hard on our boys out there on the street. Not knowing what's actually theirs and what's not. Last time we sat at this table, you called on me. Why? Because you know I'm the motherfucker who gets shit done. Always will be. Sammy raised you right, lad. Trust your instincts. Who's it gonna be, Lincoln? Well, this is all said and done. Think about who you want standing at your back. Give me the... The two of us? We're not escaping each other. Might... Make the right choice here, and I'll whip up some... Fr I trust you to make the right choice here, Lincoln. You know I'm the only Get one who will it. really have your back. This turf's going to the Irish. And what, pray tell, do you propose I say to my men who put their lives on the line for you? Forget it. 
There's nothing to be said, nothing that justifies it. I mean no fucking disrespect, but you got quite a mouth on your lass. Better luck next time, I guess. Time to get back at it. Let's clear out. <laughs> well, fuck me running. If it ain't Lincoln Clay. Surprised to see me, Alcee? Mm, I heard about Sammy and Ellis. Tough break. I guess you made it out okay. Speak of them once more, and I'll slice you from here to asshole. Let's go. We're taking a drive. Assuming I don't have a choice here. What do you think? <sighs> Lead the way. Step foot in the hollow since November of 62. Almost six years. I know. Can you at least tell me where we're going? The Acadia. It's where Tommy Marcano holds his jungle fights, right? It is. And you've been recruiting black fighters for him? I have. Good. Because I want in. What? Why? I wanted you to know I'd have told you. If I'm sticking my ass out like that, I need to know why. Motherfucker, you lucky to be alive after what you did to Sammy. You really think he wouldn't notice you stealing all that money? Look, I paid for that a hundred times over. Six years banished from the only place I ever called home. Christ. I couldn't even go see my mama on her deathbed. You made your I choice. I ain't question your driving. And now it's time to make want to pay attention. You made your choice. And now it's time to make another one. And I do this. You get a clean slate. Come and go through the hollow as you please. Fuck. Okay.
I hear if you win out, Tommy meets you in... ...person. That true? He likes the size of the winners. See if there's someone he wants to... You trying to wreck? Anyway, like I was saying, he likes the size of the winners. See if there's someone he wants to bring on regular. Or if they're just a one-time deal. Where's this happen? Usually up there in his office. One of his guys will meet you in the locker room after the fight. He'll take you to town. All right. But you might want to pay attention. Driving, but you might want to pay attention. Fighters don't take the front of the house. We go in through the side door. Who the fuck's this? This? This is Jack Knapp Johnson. What's he here for? Fuck you mean, what he here for? We here to fight, boy. Gotta search him. No weapons allowed. Do what you gotta do. Watch where you put your hands, motherfucker. Save it for the ring, dipshit. Go ahead. Locker rooms down here on the east. Can't wait to watch some paint dry after this. Motherfucker needs a doctor. Just dump him in an alley. Let nature take its course. You good now. Go on. How you, Neville? Where you at, LC? All right. I gotta go make the arrangements. Give them your name and such. You go on and get changed. Who you got with you tonight, LC? New guy. New guy looks tough. My money's staying on the brawler. I gotta ask you something, LC. What's that? Do all you niggas love beating the fuck out of each other? <laughs> so what happened? <laughs>